Hi guys, it's Lisa, the first half of Plant Mad Sisters, and today I'm going to show you how to propagate a Chinese money plant. Well, I propagate mine in soil. I know some people will probably use water, but this has worked twice for me already, so I'm going to stick with this method. One tip I would say is to make sure that the soil is always really wet. That might be wrong for other people, but it works for me um, because obviously the roots need to grow, so it will encourage the roots, the root growth. Um, so what you need to do is you need to find the little babies that your um, Chinese money plant will be producing. Um, so I have three babies that are quite large in this one, but I don't want to take them out because it really adds to um, adds, adds to the plant. Um, so I'm going to take the smallest ones and hope for the best. I know really you'd want to propagate more established plants that have more leaves on them, but I'm going to take the smallest ones. So what you want to do, I can't really show you from here, is you want to cut maybe a centimetre below the soil um, you'll find the attached uh, branch of it below there so that's what I'm just doing now um, badly framed okay so I've got my first one I'm going to put two little cuttings in here but you can see this is tiny um, probably wouldn't recommend doing it this small um, but I'm hoping it's going to work. So this has got two tiny little like roots coming off it. So I'm going to plant that in here, but I'm going to get another one out as well first. So if I put that down like there for now. So let me find the other one. Okay, here it is. So I'm going to just do exactly the same. This one's a little bit bigger. Can I get it? Yes. So you can see this one a little better. Has it got a root on it already? I'm just getting mud all over my table. Um, yeah, so you can see on this one exactly where I have cut it. So you can see there is about a centimetre that was below the soil, um, which you can then pop again in the soil. So here is my pot of soil. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a little hole with my scissors. And I think that's the root, so I'm going to tuck that in and then make sure it's all nice and tight in there. Make sure I'm not covering any of the tiny little leaves. And then I'm going to just put the other one next to it in here. I think this is like a double one. I'm going to take, oh, there's so many roots on this. Make sure I don't damage the roots when I'm just, I'm just taking off the soil. So I've got this now. I probably need to make a bigger hole for this one. Make my hole a bit bigger. I can't imagine how many silly faces I'm making during this. <laughs> right. In it goes. Make sure it's nice and secure and it's not going to fall over. So now you can see I have three little plants in here. And now for the water. Really give it a good water. I do find that I get like little flies that love the damp soil, which is a bit of a problem. But they don't tend they don't damage the plants. Um, they're just a bit horrible to see. So giving it a really good water so the water's coming through the bottom. 
is very damp. Um, and I think I tend to find that it maybe takes about two or three weeks for um, them to sort of start then growing again from being in the water, um, oh, growing again from being in the soil. Um, yeah, so that's how to propagate a Chinese money plant. Thank you for watching. Bye.